This falling text intro is pretty cool, right? You can customize your own text in just simple steps in Wondershare Filmora. Let's find out below. Hey everyone, welcome to the Filmora MVP YouTube channel. Here we teach you editing tricks, filmmaking, and camera techniques. So make sure you have subscribed to our channel, hit the notification bell to get updates. Before we start editing, click the download link in the description box. Click on the free download option. Now, a Filmora installer is downloaded automatically. Just double click on it, agree with the terms, and here you go! Filmora started to download and install. Once it's installed, it'll start and run automatically. First, change the project settings and keep the frame rate at 25 FPS. Go to the titles and drop default titles on track 1. Keep it 3 seconds and 15 frames long. Double click on the default title and select text. Change the font to Futura Bold. You can use any font of your choice. Now enter your letter. Go to the animation. Place the playhead at a starting position and change the y-axis position so that our text gets disappeared from the main screen. Now place the playhead in the one second position and change the y-axis position and bring the letter to the screen and rotate it according to your choice. Drop the letter on the ground. Now place the playhead 15 frames further and change the y-axis position to zero and change the bit of rotation. Place the playhead 15 frames further again, change the y-axis position, rotate and drop the letter on the ground. Place the playhead 10 frames further and change the y-axis position and change the rotation value. Again, place the playhead at 10 frames further and change the rotation value and the y-axis value to bring the letter to the ground. Now press OK and drop the default title on track 2 and adjust the start position on the 5th frame and shrink the size of the second letter to 315 seconds. Then repeat the same process which we used on letter M. Follow the same process to create the second falling letter. Now drop the default title again on track 3 and keep starting position at the 10th frame and keep it 315 seconds long. Then repeat the same process which we used on letters M and V. Follow the same process to create the third falling letter. Once you're done with all your letters, hide letters on track 2 and 3, take a screenshot of the letter M, and place a screenshot clip after the letter M on track 1, and keep it 1 second long. Now unhide track 2, and hide track 1, and take a screenshot of letter V, and place it after letter V on track 2, and keep it 1 second long. Do the same with third letter P. Place the playhead in the starting position of the screenshot and double click on the screenshot of the letter M and add a blank keyframe. Take the playhead 5 frames further and add a keyframe and adjust its position with the help of rotation, X and Y axis. Do the same to letter V and letter P. Now click on render preview to see the preview. That's how you can make a falling text intro like we do. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, then give this video a thumbs up. Plus, subscribe to this channel and also hit the bell icon. But don't leave without sharing this video. Leave your comment below. Bye!